Hello guys, Bubble Bricks here. Uh, as most of you know, I've been using Lego Digital Designer lately uh, to, you know, design some some mocks and stuff. And you can see on the side here uh, a couple of my SIG rigs and uh, some stuff my boys have been using. But uh, I I was having trouble finding a parts list uh, for every brick that I've used to create that particular design, um, and couldn't seem to find one. Well, I've uh, contacted Lego and uh, they provided me with uh, the directions on how to find that and I thought it would be something uh, nice to share with everyone out there. Uh, so what we're going to do is I'm just going to create a small new little mock. Um, nothing fancy. Let's, uh, let's go here. Should have thought this out beforehand. Oh, my ears. I'm recording. This is Kellen. Sorry. <laughs> Just trying to kill me. We'll just make something fun. It's fun when you chose light gray. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm not going to be a steady camera person if I keep laughing. I haven't played around with this too much. Only just a little bit. I started making something. Okay, God, turn it down. It's so loud. It's all the way up. Thank you. My ears are delicate. So what do you like with the designer? Every brick in, in production, or is it also any brick ever made? Or is it just what's in production right now? Have you looked? Okay, Drew doesn't know the answer. <laughs> I'll have to look. I do not know Sorry. the answer. Okay, I'll have to check. Just curious if it's like everything. I'm seeing a lot of recent tiles there, so I was just curious. Oh, they got the eyes. Now, if Ian was doing this, you know he'd make something epic in about two seconds. <laughs> so. Yes, my boy is much better at this than I am. <laughs> I love you. I'm just teasing. Drew is very good. Digital programs. I might be more techy and can problem solve and fix things on the computer, but Drew is better at programs like this. So there you go. Compliment. Yeah, figuring You're out. You're welcome. Like we have, um, I always play Sims, but I always make Drew make the houses for me. Because I just, it's too tedious for me. So I should just make you make my, design my mocks for me. <laughs> then it's not really my mock. No. <laughs> Darn. Okay. What are you making? I'm just making a little tiny birdhouse. Oh, it's so cute. Where is that bird supposed to go in? That little hole in the front. That's a hole? Yeah. It's a tile. That's not a hole. Well, it's... <laughs> it's representative. It's, yes, okay. it's make-believe. Okay, so here's my little... Oh, my finger's in the way. I'm a really bad camera person today. Okay, so here's my little mock. Okay? It's a little tiny birdhouse. Uh, to get the part list for this uh, creation, first thing you have to do, up in the right-hand corner here, um, there's a couple of options. There's the view mode, uh, which I'll just show you now. It does this weird, it's creepy, creepy noise, and you get that. I don't like that. The second one is the build and guide mode, which will generate your instructions uh, for that particular mock. So uh, you can go through one by one how to create the little birdhouse. Nice. And there it is. So ten steps. There it is. Um, and that's the end of this. Uh, and for the life of me, I couldn't figure out where to get the parts. So, uh, I contacted Lego, and, um, they, they told me, up in the left-hand corner here, you'll see there's this HTML tab. 
uh, in the build mode. If you click that, um, it asks you to save these building instructions um, into a folder. Uh, they automatically create this building instructions underneath the Lego Creations um, tab. So I'll say go ahead um, and save it there. So it generates the HTML guide. Okay, and it'll pop that up in a brand new window for you. Okay, so let's make that bigger. Okay, so here uh, now in HTML form is my creation. And like any other instruction booklet, uh, the last page. Uh, so if you click the end uh, tab down here. Uh, brings you to the last page and it gives you part numbers and quantity um, and a description of each brick used for that uh, that particular design. So there's a, just a quick tutorial on how to uh, get a parts list for a Lego digital design uh, mock. Uh, if you have any other questions please let me know. As always please like and subscribe. And thank you for watching Bubba Bricks' first ever how-to video. Bye. Bye.